cool. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so, so, so on that, what do you do? What do you, how do you be masakin to masmisa? Thayer says, stay with the matzah of misa. Take up our aduma, burn it, and take it. Only all of what's left is ashes. And... And... Uh, all that's left is ashes. And, and, and don't even understand why you're doing it. But, 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 but believe that you're doing mitzvahs Hashem. That means the beetle to the mitzvah... The only way you can do Paraduma is by a hispatless terrats Nashem, which is above your circle. Through that, that brings Chaim. That brings a new, a, a new life. That means, that, that means if, if, even after the year, it looks like it's huge, it looks like there's no hope. Hashem, in the Kol Yochel, the Amunah in the Kol Yochel, that, that he can bring new life. Because Bahamas, in Olam Hazer, the way it seems to us, Hashem made it in a certain way, it should look a certain way. It looks like there's no hope. The only way to get out of it is by the Amunah, that there's something higher than that. And that's going through the Matzav of Chok that brings to the Tyre of Paradun. Now, this Arab Shabbos, Parashas Chukas, there's uh, is one of the days that the Rishonim were Kovea, that, that it's a day that it's right to fast, and it's brought in the Mogan Avram, B'Shem Sefer Atani, and this is one of the days that, were, that, that there's an Indian, that Tzadikim, Yechidim, they fast on this day, because and this day was a day that there was burnt 24 Kronos Malayim Sifre Talmud Alochas Vaigodis. That's the Lushen of the Sefer Shibali Aleki. He was one of the early Achronim, like before the Beis Yosef. It was 24 wagons full and full of Sifre Talmud Alochas Vaigodis were burnt by Tzorfas. And the tzaddikim of that time, they made a she'elas chalom. They asked, asked me, "Nashomai min chalom." What, what was, uh, what was, was this a gzera? What, what kind of gzera is this? And they answered him, "Dog gzera, so rice. So this is the gzera of the Torah." Zos chukasat. That's the targum of zos chukasat. Torah dog gzera, so rice. It means. That in the and the Shibale Alek it brings that in Yom Shishi of Parshas Chukas, that's tomorrow, Friday of Parshas Chukas, is the day that it was Nigza Xera, that the Torah should be burnt. And the Torah was burnt in France, and they say that till today they know where the place was where, where the Torah was burnt. And it says over here in this article in the Rashid Nehman that it was in front of the the building of the Iriad, what's called the City Hall in, in Paris. And that's the place where the Talmud was burnt. And, there, and the Menashemam, the Omegala, that it, it has to do with the day of the week and not the day of the month. And it's Friday, Parshas Chukas every year is the day to fast. And this Gzeira. And and over here it's brought in the name of the Ramchal and the Sefer Oteros Ramchal, where it's brought the letters of the Ramchal page, Shin Mem Tes, that there was in Italy also a Gzeira of Shreyfus at Talmud. Ramchal was from Italy, and the same thing happened over there. It doesn't say what day, what. Uh, maybe it was the same day, I don't know. And uh, I don't know, but, he, but he, the Ramchal brings, Ramchal writes in a letter that, that the, that, the Shechine Moseris Atzma Lishreif, the Shechine gives itself over to be burnt, to save Klal Yisrael. That's the Indian of Parah. Duma the Parah is burnt to save Klai from Tumas Mesh. 
that saves us from too much mess. And he says, the Ramchal says, Dvarim no Roim, he says, that because when there's a time when there's no Omo Atoru, they're not Mami Satsma Mao, I'll divert to her like it says, those Chukas Atoru, and it says further in the Apostle, Adam Kiyomus Ba'oel, to be Mami Satsma in the Torah. So the Torah, there's a tremendous Kitrug on Klai Yisrael. So the Torah gives itself over La Misa, the Shreifer, to save the Klai And that's what happened on Erev Shabbos, Pashas, Chukas, that the Torah was, gave itself over to Misa, to Shreifer, to save Klai Yisrael. And that's all because it was missing an Omoa Torah. And the Ramchal says, that I was in Italy, in those countries, lo heimisu atzmom, v'holchu acharei hanos ha'olam, kichen b'chol Italia, the Ramchal says, and all Italy was like that. And they went after hanos ha'olam haza, and they weren't omo but Torah. So the Torah said, this can't be, the Torah, it's, it's like a living thing. And the Torah says, this can't be anymore like this. I'm prepared to let myself get burned to save the clouds. And the Eitzah is to be Omo Batura. And that's the Indian of the Shukas Torah. Omo Torah. And, and, and that saves the Torah itself. The Torah shouldn't have to be burned. That's the Tikkun for the Shreyfas Talmud is Omo Torah. And, and that's the Kim of the Shukas Torah. And that'll save us from that. Now, if we have a few more minutes left, yeah, I would like to 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 to, to talk about it, get down to the concrete. What is Omar? Now, I would divide it up in three parts: the, the twenty-three, forty, the physical Omar and the mental Omar And in the mental Omar I would make two parts to it. It's like this. <clears throat> the physical matter is to sit a whole day and learn is very, very hard. Not everybody can do it. And and, and you need ages how to do it. You come let somebody comes to base manager's nine o'clock in the morning and you know, a whole day I'm gonna have to sit here a whole day. And there's some people that they're, 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 they're the center of, of, of the basement, but there's some people that sit on the side and nobody looks at them. Like I remember in the mirror way back, who looked at me, who cared about me? And then they wrote a whole book about a certain person, I don't know since we think of, but who cared about Daniel Kappa? Who cared about him? But but that's all my Atari is. And no, I don't care. It's going to sit and sit and sit. But, what am I? But, 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 but then comes the mental. That's the physical, the sitting there. There's some people that every day they travel, they go to a certain place to hear a shoot. That's all my third. You know what it is to sit on a bus every day? People in America get into cars. We ain't good to hear also a lot of people get into cars. And we're talking about those that don't have cars. You have to go sit on a bus and go through the streets that are, that are, uh, takes time and it goes slowly and uh, you get frustrated sometimes. And sometimes you have to stand and sometimes it's, it, we, we don't know, like, like Rabbi Shroff Schneider once said, you have to learn Hilchus Otopus. <laughs> That's what he once said to me. The halachas of how you sit on a bus. And not to sit next to a woman, yet to sit next to a woman. I don't know, each one should do it. Each one could do it according to what he understands. But it's, it's not easy. Then the, that's the physical matter. Then sometimes it's hot in the basement. And sometimes there's people that turn on air conditioners and some people don't like air conditioners and open the window, close the window, and all kinds of things. That's the physical, um, that's all called Amatar, like I brought the Rashi Menachos, the Volva Menachos. But then there's the mental Amatar, how can you sit all day and learn? In the mental Amatar, once you do sit and learn, 
for to, to make sure every detail you went through in the Gemara. You can learn a Siga, you could gloss over it. Take one detail, one idea, and talk about it, make a thing out of it. And then argue with this one, that one. But to go through every detail, every rash, every tosis, every cash, every half a minute. And, and another part of it. And, and to go over and over again. Who does that? The Chazanish in the second Igeris, in the Igeris Chazanish, he says, the main Omar is to take the thing, to, to go over and over and over again. A dafka, then you'll find light. It'll start shining. Anybody who tries it, I'm, uh, um, I, I, I think I'm allowed to say that I'm Mavtiach, anybody who tries it, take a piece, a, a piece of Gemara, a piece of Texas, and go over and over and over again, you'll start to see it shines. It'll, you'll, your mamas feel that it's shining. But it's not easy, and that's all Mahatar. And that's the Tikkun for the Shreyfas HaTamud that happened then. And that's what we have to do. And tomorrow, those chukas are even if you don't want to fast. Not saying we can't fast very hard to fast, but but at least to remember that it's a special day of those chukas are That the Torah is tovea from us, omo omo. And we see Babylon and Saint Arab and those that are missing omo atur. There's somebody that wrote an excellent book about uh, what's his name. Uh, the name of the book is One Above and Seven Below. Uh, oh. Stark. Uh, he called himself Stark. His name, Hirschman, he called Hirschman. himself. Hirschman. he called himself. And that Omaha Torah what brings everything. And you see, but when I say no rabbi. Heskel yeah, Hirschman. Yeah. Those that don't have Omaha Torah. See Stark. What kind of hero vigid of you it can bring to it. It's unbelievable. One Above, Seven Below. That's the part of the whole side. Ah, yeah, yeah. Lower the Torah, seven straight. Seven below. To cover the eker. And 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 you have to say this. Sometimes you read in these uh, what I call rags things that people people that weren't all about Torah what they can say. It, you can mamish get sick from it. Sick mamish. Just today I saw, and I'm not and I'm not afraid to say the name. Rav Eliezer Malam. Oh! And I read today what he talked about, Hetemachim, what he talked about, the Chazanish. <laughs> it's mamish, you could get sick from it. And and I think, I think he's, Hirschman is right. And it's all because there's no Omar Torah. Mois Vacher Mosin, Mois in the Chacham, and Kavra Betar, Kavra Betar. Hashem Jerab, we should all be zoichah the tikkun where we're mamish holding close to Mashiach, he's soon coming, and we should be zoichah to be mekabu b'nei Mashiach, and everybody with his omo, that, that's what they're gonna, we're gonna take with us when we're mekabu b'nei Mashiach. Amen, 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 am